Hello and welcome to Best Camper Sales located in Stanwood, Michigan. Today we're going to take a quick look at a 2023 Gulfstream 192 DS. This camper is 23 feet overall. That's like 23.8 from the bumper to the front of the tongue. So 10 feet 6 inches from the ground to the top of the AC. It's about 3,600 pounds dry weight. It does have a little slide out. So this is a tiny camper that also has a little slide out and it's very lightweight, single axle. Uh, 36 gallon black tank, 30 gallon for the gray, 30 gallon for the black. Uh, classic wood frame construction with metal siding panels uh, and fiberglass insulation in between. Uh, it is not enclosed underbelly because it's a smaller, more stripped down camper. Uh, Gulfstream. I say this in my other Gulfstream video. Uh, they have like four brands that they label on the side, but they're all the same floor plans and same build. That's why I always just say Gulfstream. Um, you might see it as an Amerilite. You might see it as a Conquest, an Innsbruck, a King Sport. Uh, it doesn't really matter. They're all the same. They just use four different names because they have so many dealers across the country. So it's got a power or a manual tongue jack. 20 pound LP tank, battery tray. Over here you have pass through storage. Again, here's the underside, not enclosed because it's a smaller, cheaper camper. Um, I say cheaper, but they're still solidly built and they have all the essentials you would need. It's just uh, more for someone looking, not wanting to spend a whole bunch of money for the extra bells and whistles. And over here, this side, there's your one little slide out. It is a TPO rubber roof, like the vast majority of campers. The other side of your pass-through storage. Again, it is a single axle. Your city water connection hookup. Dump is down here with your low point drains. The 30 amp coach plugs into there. There's your cable hookup if you have it. On the back here you got a spare tire and just up there on the on the roof right next to the tire here is your fresh water tank fill back here's your six gallon water heater uh, that is gas only and then down here you have an LP quick connect to run off your propane tank for this little griddle that you can pull out and a little mini fridge so this camper is very small, very lightweight, but it's still got an outside kitchen. It's still got a slide out. It's got a power awning, outside speakers. Here's your furnace exhaust. Uh, you even have the solid steps, just a two-stepper because it's a small camper. So it flips out from behind the door. And they even use Moride for the solid steps, which is, in my opinion, nicer than the Lipper ones. If you ever see both side by side, you'll know what I mean. The Moride, Moride ones are just more solid, more stable. And this is also a Murphy bed setup. So if we step inside here, this is the bed down. A little wardrobe. And then the mattress. I'm trying to do this one handed. Move the mattress, flip it over, move the mattress. Lift up this piece, and it latches right here. Not really the easiest to do one-handed. There we go. Got it latched. And then you got a sofa down here. That can be turned back into a sofa so you have some more seating space there is storage underneath and over here you have outlets and USB ports over here's your kitchen so you got a dual sink with a high-rise faucet some storage up here regular microwave two burner stove does have a furnace in it over here's your radio. This will be AM, FM, and Bluetooth. You can turn the speakers on or off on the inside or outside. Up here's your control panel so you can check your tank levels, your battery level, 
move your slide out in and out, the awning in and out, um, water heater. Oh, I'm sorry, the water heater is actually electric and gas. So you can run it on electric or gas, that's my bad. And your water pump. Uh, AC is up there. And then on the slide out, you have a U-shaped dinette. Table can go down and make into a bed. Do you have the bigger 12 volt refrigerator from Dometic? Big, nice big freezer. Down here is gonna be your CO2 and LP detector and your fuses and breakers. Storage under the bunk. And you got wider bunks with lights on both bunks. Window over the top. Uh, this is your thermostat for your furnace and you can mount a tv right here obviously you want to be a little careful because the slide out comes in right there so it really has to be flush against the wall and in here you still got a you got a pretty spacious bathroom you got a tub and shower um, a lot of people like the tub and a lot of brands are getting away from the tub so if that's something you want this has it Skylight above the shower, vent and fan, medicine cabinet, sink, storage, foot flush toilet, USB ports over there. Yeah, that's a quick look at a 2023 Gulfstream 192 DS. Again, this is Best Camper Sales located in Stanwood, Michigan. You can check this camper out and others on our website, bestcampersales.com. Or give us a call anytime, 616-229-1664. Again, that's 616-229-1664. Thank you for watching.